these po these is the water gap you got to let it go so these t-posts aren't going to hold a big flow they're just gonna uh man that looks like a nine-year-old did that nick what are you talking about Try, right, ladies and gentlemen, it's radio time. If you don't keep your feed buggy in the garage, uh, you ain't no cowboy because that's what's important. We've got our priorities in line. Today we're not using it for feed, we're using it to fix a water gap, fix fence. John John, he's all over. He roams the countryside. And it's time to bring that to a screeching halt because we're gonna finally fix the water gap. Are you ready, Donnie? I'm ready. You don't sound ready. Overshot the landing. Kevin, are you so ready to go ranch? That's what it looks like to be ready to ranch. Donnie, take notes. Huh. What do we need, Donald? Where are the fence stretchers? I thought there's some in here. You just run the camera? You're getting a lot more footage today, it seems like. Here they are. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You're getting a lot more footage today. Than usual. Because you want to make sure you don't have to run any of these tools. Well, that, I just I just feel like I owe it to the people. Like, I haven't been getting enough for them. They need to know what's going on. Yeah, 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 yeah. Do we have any uh, more T-posts? Boy, that Anybody be... y'all know? I have no idea. A good question for someone else. For someone else? <laughs> be a good question for someone else. Uh, can you pull that rig over here? So where you been? Uh, well, over the forest, I went up to Oka, Utah, and Prescott, Arizona for a couple of rodeos, and then back down here. We'll shoot you. Hang out. There we go. Um, went good in Oakley, won some money in Oakley, and then no good in Prescott, but it was fun nonetheless. Glad we're rodeoing again. Yeah, for sure. I thought we hired someone for this. I thought we did too. Where is the boy? Did you say the boy? Yeah. Oh, sorry, fish. <laughs> in the face. <laughs> Nick! Nick! Are What's you coming up? or are you staying? Am I what? Are you going with us or are you staying? I'm coming. What were you doing? Put my pants on. Any day now. I've never gone through this gate, this direction, so hopefully there's not like a big ravine that's gonna keep us from getting there. Am I bringing waters? We're going to a water gap. Did you bring your swim trunks? I, I always bring my swim trunks. I'm dry. wearing two pairs of drawers right now. If it's dry, how can we call it a water gap? You know, I don't know, Donnie. I guess if it were a dry gap, though, there probably wouldn't be a lot of need to fix it. The T-Post driver and uh, cut me a bunch of wire to use to tie up, please.
Mas. A little more. Mucho mas. Mucho mas. Nah, poquito mas. It's the good right there. It's the no good. Bueno! It's kind of way far. There you go. There you go. There you go. Nope, that's three. You already got two. There you go. Right in the middle. Pull it tight. Left over right. Perfect. Now cut off a, a there you go. Pinch. Mm. Pry that some buck down. Pry that some buck. Get you some leverage. You you got it. Something wrong with your grippers. Hold on. Let me see your grippers. Yeah, I don't know. Huh? Go back to gripping with your grippers. There you go. That's a good. Now give it a twist. You'll get there. You'll get there. Okay. Yep. Now. Push that. It's off your rope. You may graduate yet. I didn't get learned in high school. Well. Now I'm learning. Radiator ranch. Radiator ranch. DB, DBU. Guacamole camp. Guacamole camp. Me and Nick went and got John John yesterday. I was driving by and I saw him standing on the neighbors. So we hustled, saddled the horses. Yeah, we did. I'll get that gate. Oh, okay. I was going to, but. Doing good, Nick. Looking good, Nick. Thank you. Woo, I get an actual high five. You didn't this time? see me actually high fiving you, did you? I, I, All right. Let's uh, forget about the high five. Let's go through here. Oh, hold on, hold on. We've got a kick job dinner. You want to go through the front or the back? <laughs> All right. <laughs> oh, wait, what? Huh? I got the T post on the other side of. Most of the T posts are on this side of the wire going down the fence, but the flow of the water is going to go this way. So my thinking is hopefully it'll just pull this, these po these, is it water gap? You got to let it go. So these T posts aren't going to hold a big flow. They're just going to, uh, man, that looks like a nine year old did that. Nick, what are you talking about? It, it looks nothing like what we talked about. I haven't, I haven't even tied it yet. Where'd you come up with that? You said put three or four around it. No. <laughs> Nick, I'm talking Got about you, one. <laughs> I thought, hey, one piece of wire. I mean, that's not strong enough. I one, mean, why not? two, three. Yeah, I got two of them doubled out of my three, but one, two, yeah. No, that's, do, do your deal. He does, you know. Shut up, Donnie. People might be complaining about catfish out here with no water, but I guarantee you catfish ain't complaining <laughs> about being out here. That's some gun. Glad to be here. Ain't you fish? Mm, mm, mm. Nick, how many you got done? Uh, one. Still on that first one? Yeah, I had to come over and help you. Oh, yeah. yeah. Is that it? I had to come help push. We're almost done. I think Nick's still on that first wire. But it's gonna look really good, isn't it, Nick? Yes. We're gonna go get something to eat. While you're finishing up that tea pot, we'll just come back and get you. Yeah, you just you just come back and grab me when y'all are done. Okay. Maybe by then you might have it maybe done. By, maybe by then I might have this one done. Yeah. And then, um, then heck, it might be dinner time by then. So don't wait up on me. Okay. It was already dinner time. It might be supper time. Jesus had the last supper, not the last dinner. That's a good point. He went biblical on you. He did. And I'm the one that went to the Baptist college. Hopefully this brush will block the last of this hole. So, as if any of this was professional. Usually you want to tie from this other side. I mean, if you imagine, just imagine pressure on this. Oh yeah. Pushing that, like it just 
hypothetically just unwinds it. Not hypothetically, it will unwind it. That's why you do it over here and you pull the wire up to the post. Makes sense. See what I'm saying? Yes, sir. You know right, Catfish? Is that right, Catfish? That's it? I was expecting like a big... Well, thank you for joining us this episode of Rodeo Time. Quick trip out to Wacamole to uh, fix a water gap. Now I'm gonna teach these fools how to set up a tack room. I'm just kidding, they're not fools. Who I'm teaching how to set up a tack room is whoever's watching episode three or four, whatever it is, of Just Ranching. Ranch stock around the clock. Excuse me. <laughs>